Hi Aries, welcome to your daily reading. I hope you're doing great today. So we're coming up on the full moon lunar eclipse in Taurus. Um, so that should be a very grounded full moon. The sun though in Scorpio with Mars and Mercury in Scorpio could be very, um, very deep emotions coming to the surface to be released. Eclipses are periods of transformation, change, letting go. So what do we have here for Aries? Oh my goodness. So I have here the card of abundance. And imagination came out. And it looks like a full moon on that card. And Scorpio is very creative. So you may be getting a lot, of, a lot of creative energy or ideas on this full moon. That's just my neighbor's dog. Like they're just barking. There's nothing wrong. <laughs> okay, let's see what we get here for Aries. Nine of Cups already. Oh my goodness. What is the celebration? Hermit. Getting some wisdom. Or wanting to pull away from people but you're actually very content or happy something is going your way six of cups a friend friendship king of wands aries leo sagittarius a very mature person and then we have i feel like you've leveled up although underlying energy six of cups could be a friend contacting you we have Virgo energy in the crossing. Emperor. Pow personal power, authority. You're in control. Ace of coin. A new opportunity for something that's real. Maybe a gift, some money, an opportunity, a contract. The Hierophant came out with that. Could be the government, could be a loan. Okay, let's see. What is Aries energy today? Aries energy. Aries energy. Hanging man. Having an epiphany. Surrendering your will. Around you is a king of pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, energy. You want the judgment. You want a rebirth. You want something to resurrect. Wow. Ten of cups, the happily ever after. There could be something about a promotion as well. Six of cups underlying those. Friendship, memories having memories from the past. It could be a person returning to you. What is Six of Cups here? Seven of Swords, oh my goodness. Something that's hidden. Hidden information about maybe from the past. Somebody could be shedding light on a situation. You feel very happy about this. Um, what is the hangman energy for Aries? You're waiting in limbo. Page of Pentacles. Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, energy. It could be you waiting for something. Ten of Swords. Feeling a sense of feeling betrayed. Queen of Wands on the bottom. Aries in a very strong position or feeling very strong. You're receiving some kind of gift, but underlying energy is somebody is not being upfront or not telling the truth about something. They're hiding something. Your energy is emperor, I feel like. So coming into your awareness is the emperor. That could be a power, a person in power. Your energy is hangman. You're waiting for something. What is the emperor here? Okay, we have the seven of swords. 
somebody it could be a person in power it could be a father a father figure anything about um an energy here of somebody who's hiding information though what is ace of coin empress something is given to you because you earned it you deserve it what is the hangman four of coin saving money holding back wow the death card there is a major change here what is the king of pentacles what is the king of pentacles somebody's carrying a heavy load or a burden on them what is the hierophant for aries in the future being given this opportunity or this gift oh my goodness surrendering your will that is the energy here having an awakening an enlightenment the energy of neptune what is ten of cups temperance emotional alchemy could be a sagittarius could be patience trying to be cooperative wow there's a the tower with that could be a sagittarius could be something unexpected here what is the queen of wands moon card something that's hidden it could be another fire sign that you're dealing with so your energy is hangman you're surrendering you're waiting you are on pause somebody has something here with the moon that they're hiding or that isn't is very mysterious what is the nine of cups What is the nine of cups there is a wish coming true page of pentacles taurus capricorn virgo energy oh my god look at this justice in the sun justice being served the sun is coming out here happiness justice served earth sign energy fire sign here the moon what is seven of swords the sneaky liar what is the seven of swords five of pentacles somebody is feeling left out in the cold they don't have they feel abandoned okay four of cups they're also refusing to part, cooperate or participate they're being very stubborn and stuck why is there a tower here i think the justice in the sun but let's see Ooh, the devil something that was toxic and what is this devil about? Okay, there was something that was disappointing or making you feel very sad, but the outcome was a, the Ten of Cups. The happily ever after, your energy is you're going to be finished waiting here. Um, you're not going to be waiting anymore. The death is here. There's the Ten of Swords, the ending of a difficult period. There could be a Capricorn around you. Capricorns are going through victories. Um, probably because Venus entered Capricorn. Six of coin, generosity, gift giving. The ending of a hard time here. The death card of the hangman. So you're done. You're finished waiting. The high priestess underlying. It's like, a, it's like something that's being held back or kept quiet. Okay, Aries, the abundance card is here with the imagination. Let's see if we can get one more. Creativity. Okay, I'm going to leave it here. Thank you for watching and take care.